Let's talk about all the different parts of the saw. So this is a safety guard when you're coming onto a piece of timber. This will automatically push back as you slide through. Here's our blade. Every saw will have an arrow. This one's here pointing this way. And then when you get a blade, it'll also have corresponding arrows. So make sure whenever you put a blade on that the arrows are going in the same direction. Otherwise you'll be trying to cut backwards and it won't work. So the Makita saw here has a trigger. If you pull that, the saw will turn on. A lot of DIY versions of tools will have a safety button as well as a trigger. The saw will not start without putting the safety trigger in and then pulling the trigger. To change the depth of your saw, release the lever, drop the depth gauge down. You can also change the angle on which the base sits so that you can do angled cut and you're ready to cut.